merch, man. It's just merch. It's just merch. Ah, it's just merch. Guys, this merch is so good, it should be illegal. Go shop at BigBearWeatherAndMore.com to get yours. Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is just going to be a short little update for the, uh, for the line fire up in those mountains over there. We are in Apple Valley right now. It is 25% contained. They just lifted the mandatory aspect of the evacuation for the Boulder Bay area. And that was the, the only part of our town that was mandatory and they just lifted it. So that's a good sign. You can see it's still super smoky over there. But that's where we're going right now to go check things out, see, see how it is. It's still smoky, but not, not so shabby. So we will be back up there shortly. But great news on the evacuation being lifted. That's fantastic. All right, as we get closer, just want you guys to see that plume of smoke. And it's, uh, it's obviously blowing from where the fire is over the Big Bear area. So we're gonna be driving into that smoke. But yeah, we'll be up there shortly. We'll keep doing small little updates until we get there. All right, this is the part of Highway 18 where if you stay straight, you'll be on 247, but we're gonna turn right here to head up to Big Bear Lake. And this is Highway 18. That's where we're going straight ahead. All right, we're almost there. Again, great news about that mandatory evacuation over by Boulder Bay and the Big Bear Dam being lifted. That's great news. I mean, that is great news. So keep up the good work, firefighters. We all love you. All right. Getting close. You can kind of see the Mitsubishi plant right over there. But this is a really neat area. Beautiful part of the high desert, I, I think. Yeah, once again, we're getting close to all that smoke up there. So be up there in a moment. Alright, we're about to make our uh, main trek up the mountain. There's our Mitsubishi plant right there. Whenever you hear somebody talk about the Mitsubishi plant, that's what they're referring to. Right at the bottom. All right, let's charge. Okay, we just crossed the 6,000 foot elevation marker. Got about another thousand to go on this road in elevation. And then we drop back into the valley. But as you can see, those the smokiness straight ahead, that's what we're driving into. Okay, we made it to the top here, top of Highway 18, about to make our descent into Big Bear Valley. And yesterday, the evacuation warnings, not the mandatory ones, but the warnings that we had on this side of town for Baldwin Lake, those were completely lifted, so there's not even any evacuation warnings over here. This is, this is awesome sauce. Again, very grateful for all the people who have been fighting this fire. It's still smoky. It still looks nasty out there though. Very nasty. It still stinks pretty bad with, with that window down, but as we get closer, I will uh, turn on the video. Okay, we just came around this corner from Baldwin Lake area, and look at how nasty it's looking out here. My gosh, a lot worse than I anticipated. I was considering maybe staying up here tonight, but seeing that, there's just no way. Not a chance. I was coughing up blood a few days ago. That's what got me to get the heck out of Dodge. 
Look at that big old plume. Yeah, the fire is only 25% contained, so it's still running amok. But yeah, look at that, guys. Look at that. Look at how nasty that is. Ugh. Remember, if you're going to be driving up here, make sure you have your, your airflow on recirculation so you're not bringing any of this outside air in. But yeah, that's just, that's horrible. Absolutely horrible. All right, well, we'll keep on doing these updates the closer we get to where I need to be. All right, you guys. Yeah, it's a lot worse than I anticipated with all the smoke. I'm going to show you guys through the sunroof uh, the direction the fire is coming from and it's super stinky and then we got this side as well it's looking just thick and nasty over there not good but anyway, we're going to go up to the little area I like to go uh, do a little 360 view. We're here at Big Bear Bill Shut Bill up to my lift! Hey, why don't you say hello to my little friend, buddy? All right. snow summit again guys like this is this is surprising it's really bad we must be in the direct wind line of this whole situation but again I, I just wanted to go to my little spot right here hop out for a quick second and then I will get this video uploaded It's getting really thick over there. Such a bummer. So let's hop out real quickly. Woo! Absolutely stinky. These hills right there, guys, are not far at all. Like you can't see see anything. absolutely reeks again for those of you who have evacuated keep in mind the great news is that the the part of town that had a mandatory evacuation that's been lifted as of about an hour ago so don't overly stress about this this is i don't know what the hell i'm talking about but this is probably just the wind blowing the smoke here all right i don't think there's anything closer i just think that's what's going on. So anyway, take care everybody. And uh, keep us in your prayers. Keep the firefighters especially in your thoughts and prayers because those are the ones who are doing something. I'm doing the best I can to get some, some information out, but I'm not brave like them. I, I, I don't have the courage like they do. If it was me who was the firefighter, there'd be nothing left on planet Earth. Anyway, all right guys, take care and I'll talk to you later.